beautiful October night in New York as we welcome you from Manhattan to the Bronx and the Yankee Stadium for game one of this division series matchup between the Yankees and the Cleveland Guardians. Paul beat Cleveland twice this year and pitched very well in both those games. His last October outing is one he'd like to put in the rearview mirror. Wild card game at Fenway last October roughed up gave up a couple of homers couldn't get out of the third inning the Yankees season abruptly ended line to first and it's right at Rizzo easy play for the four time gold glover here's some Ed Rosario the right handed hitting shortstop bounce toward the middle to his left kind of Falefa and he botches it we'll see how it will be scored it wasn't an easy play but a play that generally should be made and that's an error on kind of Falefa and it brings up Ramirez whose history against Cole is a good one five for 16 with two home runs the runner goes swing and a miss throw down from Trevino can't be handled Rosario gets the steal as Ramirez strikes out two down and here's Josh Naylor three and two struck him out swinging and he went back to the breaking ball and struck him out Cal Quantrill who hasn't lost since July he's won his last 11 decisions 15 and 5 overall he'll go for the Guardians in a city he's familiar with his dad Paul Quantrill pitched for Joe Torre and his mom and dad are here tonight to watch their son Aaron Judge narrowly missed the triple crown here is the 0 2 pitch caught the outside corner strike three called on a cutter Cal Quantrill locks up judge with a good cutter on the outside corner and that's out number one and here's Anthony Rizzo two strikeouts right away for Quantrill threw it by him up in the zone labor Torres with two out and nobody on fly ball to center straw goes back the ball carrying takes him to the track in front of the bullpen and he makes it look easy here is Andre Jimenez this ball is hit hard down the right field line in for extra bases Jimenez on his way for two as judge digs it out against the wall and he slides in with a one out double here's the DH Will Brennan struck him out they'll have to throw to first Rizzo has to scoop it turned out to be a bit more difficult than you might have guessed but that's the third strikeout of the night for Garrett Cole out number two here's Austin Hedges struck him out swinging breaking ball fourth strikeout for Garrett walked him to start the second now the Yankees get their first base runner here's Oswaldo who has really risen <laughs> the 2 2 swing and a miss strike three so that's the third strikeout for Quantrill who's not really known as a high strikeout guy second walk of the inning. So Stanton goes to second. Now the bottom third, kind of falafa. And he swings, grounds one to second. Jimenez to second one. Rosario turns the inning ending double play. So Cal Quantro gets in a jam and works out of it with a 4 6 3 twin killer. Top of the order, Stephen Kwan. He lined out to first his first time up. The next pitch. And it's hit high, hit deep to right. It's got a chance. Gone. Stephen Kwan. With a towering blast to the seats and right. And Garrett Cole gave up the most home runs in the league. 33. Stephen Kwan putting the Guardians on top. One to nothing. Up and in. It got him in the hand. Rosario hit by the pitch. And here comes Jose Ramirez. Line drive to the left center field for a base hit. So Ramirez comes through. And here goes Rosario. who will be stopped at third on the double by Ramirez and everybody is safe on a fielder's choice but a mental mistake by a gold clever at first and the bases are loaded infield moves back looking for the double play a little tapper Donaldson will come to the plate for the force Rosario is a race the bases remain loaded and it's still a one nothing game boy if Cole gets out of this mess this place will go bonkers struck him out swinging breaking ball sigh of relief from the sellout crowd. Here is Harrison Bader. Bader with the cards and the Yanks at 255 homers and 38 RBIs. Swung on, hit in the air to left field. That ball is high. It is far. It is gone to tie the game. His first Yankee home run. Oh, I'm just wild about Harry. Harry. He homers to left center, and the Yankees tie the game at one. And just think about Harrison Bader, a kid who grew up in Bronxville, was one of those kids who was here all the time. As the bottom third of the lineup is due in against right-hander Garrett Cole. First pitch of the fourth inning to the D.H. Will Brennan. Chases Cabrera into the corner, and he comes away with the catch. <laughs> the fan may have been fighting him for it, but in the end, since he came away with it, why not? Give him a high five. 
applauded by Cole. Now Austin Hedges steps in. Here's the play by Donaldson. Skids into foul territory. Fires from there and gets it. Austin Hedges retired on a terrific play by Josh Donaldson. So two web gems here in the fourth inning for the Yankees. Now to the bottom of the fifth. The Yankees will send up Donaldson. Hits one in the air to right. Gonzalez goes back on the track at the wall. And it's off the top of the wall it would appear. Or let's see. Donaldson doesn't know. He started to trot and he's going to be retired. He thought the ball left the park. So did a good portion of the crowd. They'll certainly probably look at it. Off the very top of the wall. The kind of ball that could bound either way. That's right. Could have bounded out for a homer. Came back. Donaldson went into a trot. Could have made second base if he just put his head down and ran. Now he's got to try to dart back to first and he's out. The call on the field is confirmed. The ball was in play. The battle runner is out at first base. Play stands. Now I say her kind of Falefa steps in. That is a fair ball down the right field line. He rounds first, sprints for second. Gonzalez has trouble with it. Now around second, heading for third, and makes it without a play. And this is always really one of the toughest plays to make. Well, that ball I thought was against the board, and he had to block it, but no, that was right to him. Cleveland has the infield up, play at the plate. Here is Trevino. In the air to center field. It's going to get the run home. Straw runs it down. Trotting to the plate is Kiner Falefa. And the Yankees take a 2 1 lead. Now to the top of the sixth. Oscar Gonzalez, 0 for 2. Garrett Cole notches the strikeout on Gonzalez to start the sixth. Two quick outs in the Guardian sixth. Swung on and missed. Eighth strikeout for Cole to the bottom of the six. That'll be a steal and a throwing here. And Cleveland's defense is letting them down here in the last two innings. A judge at third, no one out. Yanks with a golden opportunity. It'll be a 3 2 to Rizzo. Swung on, hit high in the air to right. That ball is high. It is far. It is gone. Second deck. Oh, Rizzo rakes once again. And as you know, nobody beats the Riz. He is a two run jack to right. And the Yankees take a 4 1 lead. Now we go to the seventh, and Garrett Cole is out there. And the catcher, Austin Hedges. Down to third base, Donaldson. Across the diamond, plenty of time to get Hedges for the first out. Tanner Falefa leap, but had to go off the top of his webbing. So there's a runner on first with one out, and here is Boone. Appreciative ovation for Garrett Cole, who leaves with a 4 1 lead. And hang the ball off to Jonathan Lewisica. 15 of his last 17 games, no runs allowed. Juan goes the other way for his second hit of the night, and the tying run will come to the plate. Ahmed Rosario, he had 11 home runs during the regular season. Toward the middle. Kiner Falefa fields it, steps out of the bag, and turns it into a double play. So the Yankees are one out away. And here is right hand inning Miles Straw. In the air to center field. Straw is retired, and that is the last straw tonight for the Guardians. Ball game over. Yankees win. The Yankees win. So they win the first game of the best of five division series.